Hey guys, I'm Rosma. Um, I have this weird cast thing on my hand because I have carpal tunnel from repetitive movement. Um, I'm going to do a giveaway for this brand Formulate. Um, let me tell you, it took a really long, long time to find the right formula for me because I do have so many head allergies. Um, so they did customize the formula. I did ask if they could go fragrance free, but they can't because fragrance free doesn't actually exist. Um, so we finally decided on an orange formula. So I'm going to be unboxing this for you guys today. And we'll just look and see what we got. Um, I'm also going to be doing a giveaway on this channel um, for a formulate. And uh, this was customized for me because my old shampoo and conditioner people I used to use, they went out of business. So I had to find someone new. So I'm just going to be using my key because it has like a little like cutter on it. And I don't want to like stab in the box. So here we go. Just doing the tape right here. That actually was not that hard. Is that the only tape? Hmm. I think it is. I think that's the only tape. If, if I was smart, I could do this. Aha! You pull it out like that. Oh. And then it comes with a little card. Um, it tells me who my personal chemist was who was probably very irritated, and my formulation technician, who was probably also very irritated um, with all my different demands. Um, so I said I have brown, medium, oily, dry, wavy, shoulder length. I sort of need to get cut. Um, uh, hair, and I, I have very sensitive head, obviously. Um, I want hydration, which they have me at 45, strengthen, 25, deep conditioning, 15, volumize, 10, and glossy hair, 5. Um, it tells you how to get there. Um, it tells you how to get there, and then it has an ingredient list. So I got freshly squeezed. I finally decided I'm freshly squeezed because I had so many allergies. I finally decided on, yeah, decided on freshly squeezed, which is orange, tangerine, and citrusy sweet orange. It's very lightly scented, by the way. I do not want a lot of scents. Uh, they have blood rain algae extract, saw palmetto, to, and sea kelp bioferment. That just means that it ferment, fer, fermentation ah, was done with bacteria that is in yogurt. Um, the saw palmetto is for uh, thinning and for uh, sebum, which is just oil um, in my hair. I have a lot of really oily roots, but my ends are sort of dry. I think that's in dead. They're just dead. Um, I think that's because uh, it just tells you how everything is. Uh, it also on the back has an ingredient list, so you can complain some more about your ingredients if you don't like them. Like I said, it took them a very long time to figure mine out. Uh, so I have my personalized conditioner with my name and when it was formulated. <laughs> it says formulate on the bottle. And oh, this conditioner. Oh, personalized conditioner. Personalized shampoo. Very sleek bottle. Sleek uh, stuff too. It's like it's not ugly or anything. And I don't know what the heck this is. They put it in there for something. For some reason or another, they gave me something. They didn't tell me what it was. Uh, pumps. So I can just pump the shampoo and conditioner out. So that I don't 
So I'm not like wasting a ton of product. So let's see. Okay, it is lightly scented. It's not that bad, honestly. It's very sweet smelling, honestly. Hmm. Well, um, that's a little bit of a problem. As you can see, there's like a cap right in there. I think it just solidified, honestly. We're going to have to talk to the peoples about this. Because it feels like it's liquid underneath, but the top definitely solidified. Let's see if it's... So, I'm dumb. These are caps. And if I was smart, I'd know how to take them off. If I had nails. Okay. Now I can smell it better. Very lightly scented. I tried to open it with my teeth. Don't do that. It's a really, really unpleasant experience. So, there's my conditioner. Let's see if I can get this open without using my teeth because that was really gross tasting. Let's see if I can use my keys to do it. You can. Be careful if you are in a different area than when you're, than where your formula was formulated. I think this was formulated in California. Let me double check. I was wrong. It was formulated in Montana. But the pressurized difference is very large. Just because I live way, way above sea level. And so the pressurized difference is very, very large. So just be careful. Um, I made a little bit of a mess on my bed. It looks disgusting. Um, I'll just have to wash that comforter later. But honestly, uh, just be careful of what happens. I'm just going to keep these caps for later. I don't know why. I'm going to keep the caps. I'm going to keep the caps in case, yeah. So, just be careful because these things will explode all over the place. I got some in my mouth. It does not taste very good. It tastes very soapy. So, um, be careful if you are in a lower or higher pressure area than where this was formulated. That's all I would say about that.